Hello friends, it's Rix. I'll be showing you guys some hidden commands and useful combos for Ranger of Black Desert Online. We'll be working our way up starting from easy easy skills to the harder skill for Rangers, and I highly recommend mastering each skill before proceeding onto the next one. Enjoy the video! So firstly, we'll start with AoE shot. Simply click right mouse button and then click left mouse button. Repeat the process and you'll get a lot of mana back in a short time if you're attacking a bunch of mobs. Next up is Will of Wind Cancel. Move left or right and then gently caress your F. Well done, this is one of the hardest hitting moves for Ranger. The downside is that it will use a lot of mana and stamina in like 5 seconds. Well, your enemy will die in 2 seconds, so who cares. We're moving on to Call from Sky. The command says press space after shooting an arrow while running, but I'm too dumb to follow that command so I use charging kick instead. Of course you'll need, you'll need a point in charging kick, but I assure you it's worth it. Also you can use your hidden commands by following up with either left click or right click. It's good fun jumping around while your enemy tries to catch you. This one's just a recap for most of you, evasive explosion shot or EES for short. Simply click left after backflipping with evasive explosion shot and then you'll shoot an umbrella of arrows around you. Note that damage of this hidden skill is affected by bow skill. So if you plan on using this, you'll need, you'll need to max that out. This one's also a basic combo, kick cancel shot. Simply kick, press A or D as soon as possible, then click left. Once you've once you have that activated, you can hold your left click and then start spamming F and then A, or you can sp uh, you can move right by spamming F and then D, and it just keeps on using kick cancel shot. It's pretty neat when you need to confuse your enemy or mix it up with some of your combos to get your mana back. So yeah. Now this one's a lazy skill. I use it for some boss runs like um, daily red nose and daily bags and stuff like that. You can you can use Razor Wind continuously by cancelling the last shot with pinpoint. Simply hold down S while your Razor Wind is firing. Then it will shoot a pinpoint. After that, spam E to activate your next Razor Wind. You don't have to worry about mana cost, so it's pretty lazy skill and deals somewhat damage. Blasting Gust Cancel or Gust Cancel. Your gust cancel will look like this, if it doesn't, you're doing it wrong. Firstly hold Q, secondly hold A or D, and then finally hold left click. Don't let go of anything, just hold everything and it'll be fine. Just alternate between A or D if you want to switch your movement back and forth. You can use gust cancel on a number of mobs to gain mana quickly, but note that it doesn't do much damage and it will drain your stamina quickly. Now, let's mix, let's mix that up with some camera locking. You can see that my character's looking forward and attacking forward. This is a normal thing, right? And by turning my camera 90 degrees to the right and holding middle click, this, which is a scroll button, yes, click on it and then hold it. And then turn it to the direction that you want to attack. And now you can see my character is facing right side and attacking forward. Simply add this camera locking to Blasting Gust Cancel and it will look like this. This is the fruit of Ranger, this is everything. If you practice really hard you can do it, it took me like a week to get this right. If you have to change your keys to make it work, do it. If you have to, go buy another mouse where you can assign a middle click to another button on the side. I know it costs like 20 bucks. Um, if you still can't do this no matter what, you have to play another class. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to those out there, like... Like, if you cannot do this no matter what, you have to play another class. If you can't do this, you will die in every PvP battle. You will die everywhere, you, you just will die. Okay. So, you can use this to catch low HP enemies running away from you. Uh, or you can run away from enemies, or even kill enemies from a distance as Blasting Gust has surprisingly long range. Alright, congratulations! You made it this far. 
you've probably heard about shotgun, right? It's ultimate charging wind or SP charging wind. There are st three stages of shotgun. Firstly, activation. Secondly, sustain. And thirdly, de delay cancellation. Firstly, activation of shotgun. Yes, you can start off by using evasive shot, but that's too easy for us, right? So why not start with kick cancel shot or and press space? Or you can put a debuff on your enemies by starting it off with Will of Wind cancel or Gust cancel. You, you have to press and briefly hold spacebar to activate shotgun. And this is important, the debuff. You want to use your debuff, okay? And then, secondly, the sustain of shotgun. You probably noticed that shotgun knocks you back a little from the target and this is especially noticeable with SP shotgun which is why I reverted back to ultimate but that's up to you anyway activating shotgun after activating shotgun hold A or D your left click and spacebar hold them together and do not let go of anything or try to try to tap any buttons or keys and you can negate the knockback a little by holding W together with your A or D or you can even move further back by pressing S with A or D. It's basically using evasive shot except you're holding down spacebar. Simple, right? Next is the important part, especially in PvP, delay cancellation. You can see that during the delay, spamming my directional key doesn't help at all. But if I try to spam pinpoint and cancel it with ultimate evasive shot, it'll get me out of the delay a little faster. And the fastest way to get out is using EES. So if you plan on using EES, make sure you calculate your mana before going ham with your shotgun. So that ends our three chapters of shotgun. And now you might be thinking, what would be harder than shotgun? But yes, there are harder combos and videos that the video is still not finished. And here's a bunch of razor wind, tearing wind, and penetrating wind combos. I wasn't going to do these videos, but I thought complete video would be better, so some part 2 or part 3 bullshit in an attempt to get more subscribers is... We don't, we don't like that, right? Because I already know that you're not going to subscribe anyway. Okay, let's get started. Some of you may have heard of Railgun. I know some, a lot of you didn't, but Railgun is a thing. It's penetrating wind without the pre-delay by linking it up with Razor Wind. Uh, note that you will need Flow, Kiss of the Wind. That's the last flow on your skill tree. And the flow requires you to have Penetrating Wind maxed out and at least level 3 on Razor Wind. So it's a lot of skill points, I know. And simply press E, hold Shift, and then press right click. And it will shoot like 2 or 3 Penetrating Winds at once. And although Kiss of the Flow says you can only use it with Razor Wind, that is not true. You can also use it with Tearing Arrow, and you'll notice that you can do the same combo with Razor Wind, except it'll be a little slower because it waits until it fully charges the first bar. You can remove this delay by simply shooting one arrow and then following up with Shift and right click. This is great for boss runs because it deals just a little less than shotgun, but you're using the longest skill, which makes you pretty safe from the boss's one-shot kills and sh stuff like that. And so, yeah, why not save those crystals you worked so hard to snatch off the marketplace? Next up is Continuous Penetrating Wind. It requires you to have Flow Sharp Feather 1, which lets you fire Penetrating Wind after landing, I repeat, after landing a round kick. The mechanic is that by kick cancel shotting and landing an arrow, I repeat, landing an arrow on the target, the follow up combo which is penetrating wind can be activated because the game thinks you landed a kick. So you actually didn't land a kick but you landed an arrow but the game thinks you landed a kick, okay? You can say it's a glitch but it has not been fixed since what? Forever. So here's how you do the combo anyway. Kick cancel shot to your desired location. Immediately press hold shift while holding down F and left click. 
So you're holding three buttons after kick cancel shot. Shift, F, and left click. And then tap on A or D and watch your character repeat kick cancel shot and then penetrating wind combo. Note that it must land the arrow, if not the combo breaks. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, this is continuous penetrating wind. So you've mastered continuous penetrating wind, but you want to go further. Here's penetrating still shot for you. You'll need both flows, sharp feather 1 and kiss of the wind. Simply kick cancel shot to the left or right, then immediately press and hold shift while holding left click. Then tap on F to continuously fire penetrating wind on the same spot. The timing of tapping F has to be precise. Personally, I do this when my character shoots penetrating wind, but it could be affected by your latency, so try to practice and find your own time. Okay, we're almost there, my friends. This is just a quick tip on switching to battle stance. I usually move left or right and then left click to quickly fire a shot. And then I follow up with either shotgun, will of wind, or even gust cancel. Um, you can also use descending current or call of, the, uh, call of the earth to switch quickly or any other skill on the hotkey, but why would you want a hotkey if there's a command for the skill? And lastly, I'm giving away my biggest secret. I call this a forestation. This is basically kick cancel shot, except that you press whatever hotkey for your call of the earth. And this lights up the area, making your character look fabulous, which keeps enemies from attacking you. Alright, thanks for watching guys. If you liked the video, give the thumbs up button a gentle spank. And please subscribe if you like to see more Black Desert Online contents in the future. Enjoy your new combos and let me know if you find any other hidden commands. Have a good day.